This example shows a second strategy involving unit analysis that can be used to convert between units. Here we're going to convert 5,500 decimeters into hectometers. Again, we're going to need to use a conversion ratio. Let's use the prefix table to determine a conversion ratio. We're interested in converting decimeters to hectometers, and 0.01 hectometers equals 10 decimeters. As with the previous conversion ratios, this can be written as a fraction equal to 1 in two different ways. 10 decimeters divided by 0.01 hectometers is equal to 1, and 0.01 hectometers divided by 10 decimeters is equal to 1. To use the unit analysis strategy, begin by writing the known measurement. Next, select the conversion ratio that has the same unit in the denominator. Now multiply the original measurement by this conversion ratio. Notice that the original units, the decimeters, reduce and we're left with the desired unit, hectometers. Simplify and evaluate this expression on the right side of the equation. So 5,500 decimeters is equal to 5.5 hectometers. Let's look at what would have happened if we'd chosen the other conversion ratio. Again, multiply the original measurement by the conversion ratio and evaluate. Multiplying decimeters by decimeters gives decimeters squared. This product is then divided by hectometers, giving unit of decimeters squared divided by hectometers. It is a very unusual unit, and not the one we're asked to find. When using the unit analysis strategy, it's extremely important to show all units and show how they reduce to ensure you've used the correct conversion ratio.